my son Daniel has always been obsessed with balls. When he was born, his first words were, I like balls. He always likes to have some sort of ball in his hand. Beach balls, baseballs, snowballs, eyeballs, even ball caps. That's about as appropriate as it gets. Every day he wakes up at 5 in the morning to the sound of the roosters and starts training in hopes of becoming a ball boy. Just about every day he tells me, Dad, I want to be the best ball boy this world has ever seen. I'm going to be the best ball boy this world has ever seen. Let's go, let's go, huddle up guys, huddle up. He takes stretching very seriously. He don't want to pull nothing. All right, let's go. All set. Down. He does his right, push-ups. One more, one more. All right, three more, three more. All right, two. One, one more. All right. Nice. Oh. Man, I'm an animal. He does his right, sit-ups. All right, 39. All right, 72. Four. All right, one more, one more. You got, you got this, son. Oh. Let's go. All right, there we go. Nice. You know, I bought my first car when I was 22, named it Red Lightning after my idol, Red Lightning, the Florida State University uh, ball boy. And uh, Daniel, I, I have to pay homage to him. Daniel, what are you doing? What? Daniel, what are you doing? Lastly, he pushing in his oh, van. We're, doing the, we're, we're working out right now? I thought we were going home. No, oh, I got to work out right now? Oh, okay. I got to work out with uh, Red Lightning. Come on, push. Come on, you thought you were done. You gotta push this gosh darn van. Come on. It's not that hard. Just push. Come on. Come on, 20 yards to go. You got this. Your tail is small. What? Come on, push, push, push. Ah! Come on, you're almost there. Ah! You're almost a quarter way there. Come on. Great. All right, nice. You're there. You're there. Woo! Woo! What are you doing? I stopped. In part. Why? Because the car was still moving. If it's a neutral, it keeps sliding backwards. Because it's downhill. Oh. Darn it, Daniel. My fault, Dad. No, stop. <laughs> stop. No, stop. Stop. Ah! Even his coaches in middle school told me that he just wasn't going to be as good as he thought he would be, and that he would never become a pro ball boy. Even his mom isn't very supportive. She wasn't even here when he was born. But that didn't stop him from achieving his goal. Yeah, yeah, you know, I've always dreamed of becoming a pro ball boy ever since I held my first ball. Like, it was it was that amazing. Like, uh, I've basically been training since I came out of the womb. Uh, as you guys know, my mom, she she wasn't there for my birth. Like, she wasn't present. My dad had to, my dad took me home from the hospital. He raised me. Um, he actually gave me my first ball and uh, yeah, I, I live and breathe to, to dry the balls of the quarterback at any given moment of any game. And uh, I really want things to work out for me in the future. You know, another thing we've heard is that you also really like Red Lightning. Oh, Red Lightning. You know, he has always been my idol. I'm actually really glad you brought him up. I, I, uh, what I would give to dry balls with that man and just run balls in with Red Lightning. He is great. One of my idols. What are five things that you would have if you were deserted on an island? Five things that I would have? Oh my gosh, let me tell you. This is easy. I'd have a beach ball, a snowball, definitely an eyeball, uh, a baseball, and most definitely, definitely you cannot forget a ball cap. Balls. Gotta love them. Woo! That's my son! Woo! Ball team and Brian with their team. So you don't worry. There's red lightning. There's red lightning right over there. So Alright, how do you feel tonight, yeah, Daniel? I'm feeling, so I'm feeling great. I'm ready. I'm ready to finish out the game. Yeah. Country roads take me home to the place.